Hi viewers, welcome to LMS Solution. Today we are going to see about how to use uh, ChatGPT for generating uh, code, MATLAB code for tuning the PID controller by using genetic algorithm. So here you can, I am going to use ChatGPT for tuning of uh, PA controller. So for example, <coughs> you consider some transfer function okay so like uh, I'm going to consider 1 divided by s plus 1 okay so this is the transfer function or plant model so for the plant model I'm going to design so this is a plan so in between I need to add controller so here I'm going to add controller so this controller nothing but uh, uh, PA controller and then here you can see that say this is output response and then here we have a plant okay plant and the controller and then here i have summing block so this is output and then i'm going to take feedback okay so here i'm going to take feedback so here we have plus and minus and here we have reference okay reference should be followed by that plant so here we have pa controller so here we have error and then output of pa controller nothing but to control the voltage and it going to be control this plant and then the plant output should be follow this reference okay so here you can see the pa controller that pa controller have two parameter nothing but to kp and ki okay so this kp and ki normally uh, we can choose that value based upon a trial and error method or else a mathematical calculation so or else you can use any optimization method okay so in this video i am going to use a genetic algorithm okay so ga i am going to use ga ga nothing but a genetic algorithm so by using genetic algorithm i am going to choose the value for kpk for this closed loop system okay so the ga going to be used used to, to reduce the the error right that means this error and that means here we are going to consider some error so here i am not define anything in that uh, uh, system because i am going to uh, provide some prompt to the chat gpt and then i am going to get the uh, detail from the um, chat gpt and then you have to execute the things in the matlab so how the chat gpt will be create matlab code for tuning of the pa controller by using genetic algorithm for a particular plant okay so in this video we have to explore this concept okay first i'm going to go to chat gpt so this is uh, chat gpt already all of you know right uh, you can go to openai.com that means chat uh, chat.openai.com and then here you will see that prompt so in this prompt you have to provide some question so based upon that question the chat gpt going to be understand the question and it going to be provide some uh, data so here i am going to provide the question write matlab code for tuning of kp and ki parameter of the pi controller for transfer function 1 divided by s plus 1 using genetic genetic algorithm okay so like that i am going to ask the question to the chat gpt that means i am providing prompt to the chat gpt and then you have to see the result of the code from the chat gpt so here you can see that here we are getting the uh, code for a tuning of pa controller for the plant 1 divided by s plus 1 by using uh, genetic algorithm okay so here you can see that after generating the code right so here you can see that uh, it have some uh, instruction in this code first you have to say transfer function of the system 1 divided by s plus 1 and then calculate calculate objective function calculate the integral absolute error for given kpk parameter 
uh, here they are using GA right GA that means uh, default uh, a code for genetic algorithm okay so now I'm going to copy this code and go to MATLAB and I'm going to open new script okay so here I'm going to open new script and paste here okay so this is a code uh, we are taken from the term chat GPT so here we have to review that code right so here you can see that uh, this is numerator and this is denominator okay and then uh, this is a system transfer function by using transfer function block okay and then here they are uh, uh, fixing that objective function okay calculate objective and then this is for uh, option option uh, they provided for genetic algorithm like a maximum number of generation and the uh, population size okay and then uh, this is the uh, uh, execution of the genetic algorithm okay so uh, while this execution i think uh, it go to objectives objective it will be called call objective so it, it will be comes here right and then uh, here uh, create the controller controller pid kpki and then here closed loop feedback controller that means it create the feedback control logic okay and then they are getting the response and then so here you can see that it will be a calculating the error and then here they calculating the objective function okay so now I'm going to execute this one so I'm going to store the detail so, but here you can see that we have some error right so what's the error you have to see that uh, your fitness function must return scalar value right so that should be scalar value okay so here you can see that the code i think everything correct so it, it problem with only fitness function so just to go to verify the fitness so this is a fitness function so i'm going to <coughs> verify this one here you can see here right uh, the value of fitness function is like uh, array of value right so in order to get the better result so just you go to use mean mean value otherwise you can provide mean here also mean 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 means we are taking average okay average of the total error okay so here i'm going to execute this one now So now I think it's taking that code I think because the previous code is everything is correct okay so everything is correct so what happened right so that objective function that means fitness function is having that array of value right so normally in MATLAB they are not taking uh, uh, that uh, this is used for single objective problem right so it, it cannot be handled that uh, the multi array value of the fitness value right so that's why i am here we are make that objective function is uh, mean mean wait, that means we are taking average of the total error okay so now here you can see that we are getting the value for kp and k so this is uh, a optimal value we are uh, that mean obtained from the uh, genetic algorithm for that uh, pa controller right so we can use chat gpt for generating code for tuning of a uh, uh, PA controller parameter for a particular plan okay and then after getting the code right just you go to review the code and then you can change some minor thing right then you will get the results so this is a video about tuning of PA controller by using genetic algorithm and code is taken from the chat GPT thanks for watching our videos kindly subscribe our channel and also click bell icon for notification about upcoming videos thank you thank you so much bye bye